Saturday, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing a full case break of 1718 Panini Donruss Optic Basketball 12 box. Pick your team number seven from jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is our last break, too. Our last case of Optic Basketball. So thanks to everybody who uh, filled up, helped fill up all these breaks. So on a Saturday, basketball playoffs just started. There's J-Mac with the last spot mojo. Warriors taking care of the Spurs rather easily. And we are watching the tail end of the Raptors-Wizards game right now, where the Raptors have started to pull away from the Wizards. Thus ending this weird streak for the Raptors. I think I, think I just heard the announcer say nine opening games in a row they've lost. Home games, I think, that they've lost. It was kind of crazy. All right, so let's get let's get this started, ladies and gentlemen. Got to stretch out my wrists a little bit. Get them warmed up for this break. Alright, good luck everyone. The Raptors are going to be pretty scary this year, folks. Yeah, Patrick, I, I have the game on. We, I have a television here. I got the game on right now. And the game cast up as well. Both. And look at all the stats, too. I think it's the Raptors. Uh, I think it's the Raptors bench that is really giving them the edge here, because the Wizard starters look they look great, but their bench not so great. All right, there's Justice Winslow to lead things off. Saw Pascal Siakam hit a nice three. There's Dion Waiters. And Caleb Swanigan for the Trailblazers. For the Heat, Landon with the Heat. Orange Dion Waiters out of 199. There's Josh Jackson, the rookies. Redemption. Any uh, any guesses on that redemption, folks? bragging rights there's Ryan Anderson pink velocity twenty four out of seventy nine for the Rockets Cham Bazier Robert Ori Tyler Lydon rated rookie green that'll be for the Denver Nuggets out of 175, that's lime green. Robert Ory, champions here blue for Lakers, for the Lakers. 28 out of 49. Nice one for Ricky. Robert Ory has a bunch of, he has, I think he has like seven rings. You guys realize that? There's DeAndre Jordan for the Clippers, red. Thirty-five out of ninety-nine. Clippers. Patrick, you only get one guess. You can't just put like three guesses. You might as well just list the entire checklist. Damian Dotson. What's your one guess? Damian Dotson Hollow. A 
That's for the Knicks. All right, Patrick's one guess is Dan Smith Jr. And it's going to be, bam, Josh Jackson. Rated rookie signatures hollow, Josh Jackson. That's last spot mojo and J-Mac. The Suns were just sitting there. They were just sitting there. There you go, nice. There you go. That'll, that'll, that'll warm up J-Max Day in Wyoming. All right, next box. Windy Wyoming. All right, it looks like the, well, the Raptors, they still have to cover, but I got the over though. 114. The, the the over I hit. Yeah, the Warriors, man. I thought the Spurs were gonna be pretty competitive. Uh I don't I didn't think they were gonna win. Maybe outside chance, but they're pretty competitive. But I I thought they were gonna be pretty competitive, but they weren't, John Peterson. The Warriors just from the get-go were great. I I think the I think the Spurs kind of went off to a little 7 nothing run at the beginning of the second half or something like that, but that was about it. After that, the Warriors just pulled away. And they were comfortable. I did not see any post-game stuff. Well, I can't, I can't imagine Popovich would be very happy with that performance. Oh, nice. Rex saying there's only three left in the Angels spot random. There we go. So yeah, once we fill up spot random 19 and 20, we can do that one box break of tribute. Obviously, we have to finish this first. We still have another 50 minutes left in this. But yeah, we should be able to. I should be able to get done as soon as I finish this one. At about six o'clock Pacific, nine o'clock Eastern. This guy has to step up. John Patterson says, or Peterson says, Warriors in five? I mean, if not less. There's Terrence Ferguson. Rated rookie out of 199 for the Thunder. That'll be for Jaden. We got Caleb Swanigan, red, rated rookie. 89 out of 99. De'Aaron Fox, Fox in the box, lime green. That Swanigan will go to William L. and his trailblazers. We'll see them in action later tonight. And that lime green, 77 out of 175. Lime green, Fox in the box for the Kings. That'll be for Ricky Buffalo. Actually, I'll, this is one of the bigger name rookies, I suppose. So let's top load this really quick. It's not that's not as common as the rated rookies either, which makes it cool. And Oscar Robertson. Wow, Oscar Robertson Hall Dominators autograph for the Milwaukee Bucks. One out of 49. Who's got the Bucks? Jaden with the Bucks. Nice. Very nice. There's Larry Nance Jr. Lime Green. This last case of uh this last case of optic basketball producing an Oscar Robertson. Crazy.
There's a Retro Stars Hollow as well. That'll ship. One seventy one out of one seventy five on that Larry Nance Jr. That's still Lakers edition. Nice Oscar Robertson to start things off. So Josh Jackson first auto. Oscar Robertson second auto. Well, next box. Let's see what's in the next one. Yeah, the Jackson Redemption was was a hollow. The silver, the prism, the refractor, whatever you want to call it. It goes by so many names. I think the Rap Raptors did not cover that. Well, they, they pushed. But I did get the over on that game. Our right, next game is going to be Miami. Oh, this is going to be a good one. Miami at Philadelphia is the next game. And we'll see Damian Lillard later tonight against the uh, hosting Pelicans. There's Al Horford. Orange, that'll go to Jeremy Merle and the Celtics, 197 out of 199. Jason Tatum as well, the rookies. There's Bam Adebayo, 27 out of 79. We'll see him in just a little bit. Pink Velocity going to the Miami Heat. That'll be for Landon. DJ Wilson, hollow. Hollow. Devin Booker for the Suns. Swishful thinking for J-Mac. 33 out of 99. So all of these will be top loaded before they get shipped out. Just in the interest of time, we're going to kind of breeze through these. JJ Redick, we'll see him in a little bit. There's Vinsanity, the Ageless Wonder. That's for the Kings. That'll be for Ricky, 139 out of 199. And the Bucks with the Rated Rookie Hollow for DJ Wilson. And the last bit here, Lime Green, Terrence Ross, Magic, and Josh Hart. Rated rookie auto. I was wondering where the auto was. Rated rookie auto, Josh Hart. For my Lakers. That goes to Ricky Buffalo. Nice. Nice bright spot for the Lakers. Well, a lot of bright spots for the Lakers this year. They just need to put it all together. I think Josh Hart is going to be a big part of that. I think at best... Pretty, we're pretty excited about Josh Hart here in LA. We're at best, you know, he could be a he could be a solid starter. 
at worst, I think he'd be like a great off the bench guy, maybe a six man contender, perhaps. Lakers need a lot of pieces on that team, so every little bit helps, no matter the role. Oh, J Mac wants to. While we're at it, now that we got the Josh Jackson out of the way, we'll take a Jason Kidd autograph. Suns edition. Although I think there's usually only one of those, only one of those old school guys in each case. But I don't know. Maybe this is a special case. All right, so who does everyone have in this game? Miami is in Philadelphia. The Sixers playing without Joel Embiid, but they still looked good at the end of the regular season. However, they were playing playing some pretty uh, pretty cream puff opponents, you know, pretty soft opponents down the stretch. But they did look good doing it. I think I took Miami and the points, plus seven. I think Philadelphia will end up winning. But I took Miami, plus seven. And, um, and the under, under 212. Um, the Oscar, check what? Oscar Robertson, auto, I doubt there's a lot of Oscar Robertsons. That might have been one of the first ones pulled, Jaden. Or try looking at sold items. You'll get a good idea of the value there. There's Lou Williams Orange. Out of 199 for the clip show. There's Jordan Bell Hollow. That's for the Warriors. Won comfortably today. Andre Drummond, pink velocity. He had a great season. And that's 69 out of 79 for the Pistons. That'll be for Chris Newton. And, oh, I guess there are more old school guys. Artist Gilmore, signature series. That'll go to EA. Chris Middleton. And we've got a lime green. Gershon Yabuselli for the Celtics. And there's Dan Asell Retro Series. Blue. That goes to the Nuggets. 20 out of I like the old Nuggets logo from back in the day. Uh, Nuggets, that'll be for Jaden and Jeremy Merle with the Celtics. Also, Jaden, um, if you don't see it in sold auctions, try looking up uh, Oscar Robertson autographs just in general at a Panini product. Say like similar kind of product like like uh, Select Basketball or Prism Basketball out of 49. I don't think uh, an old school guy like him, his, his, 
his prices aren't gonna aren't gonna be too too crazy different from product to product. So that might give you a good general idea of what the price uh, of what the price would be. And make sure you uh, look at completed and sold auctions as well. So Patrick saying that the Sixers will win game one. No one else has opinions, Patrick. But thank you. He's, he has the Sixers winning uh, first game at home. You know, Saric has been playing really well, too. Especially without MB, Dario Saric. Dust off your Dario Saric rookie autographs from last year. He's having a nice second, second year of the season. Aside from, like, Whiteside, the, the Heat don't really seem to have, like... Maybe Dragic don't seem to have like big names on there, but but they had a great they had a great season. I think Bam Adebayo is going to put in minutes. You know, you know, Dwayne Wade will put in his time too. Justice Winslow has been playing a lot better, but they've they've got some uh, they've got some balance. All right, Kyrie Irving, pink velocity. Poor Kyrie. And there's Jason Tatum, hollow the rookies. That's pretty strong. So these hollow versions, definitely the ones that are sought after, the ones that are coveted. And both of those will go to Jeremy Merle and the Celtics. There's poor Kyrie Irving, five out of 79. John Wall, he's back. And there's Alfonso McKinney signature series. I, I don't think I have any idea who this is. David Shaw with the Raptors, but there you go. Signature series Alfonso McKinney coming your way. I have no recollection of this person here. Nice hollow Lori Markinen. And Paul Millsap Blue. Oh, nice. Rex saying Angels random for number 19 is sold out, and number 20 is down to 7. Well, that's good. I mean, no, no need to push it too hard, Rex. We still have like 35 minutes to go in this one, 40 minutes to go in this break. 30 out of 49. Atlanta Hawks, Paul Millsap, Jared Parr, and the Lori Market and Hollow goes to EA with Chi-Town. Chi-Town Bulls. Ivan Rab rated rookie hollow. Kobe. Al Farouk Aminu for the Trailblazers. And 17 out of 39. Black Velocity, Eric Gordon for the Rockets. James with the Rockets. William L. with the Trailblazers out of 99. And then for the Grizz, Ivan Rab, hollow. And there's poor Gordon Hayward, lime green. Another one for the Celtics, another one for Jeremy Merle. 38 out of 175. Oh, I see. Right, right, right. Because then. Oh, so you, you're in the spot randoms, Rex. Nice. Well, that's good. Unless he, then he's just like, well, because. I want to push it because then we got to push selling out the uh, three box break, the pick your teams. Unless he doesn't get the Angels, then he's just like, well, then I won't care. <laughs> you should care, Rex. You should care because the sooner we sell those out, the sooner I can post more. The sooner you can try again.
All right, next box. more packs to go. And good luck everybody. Next box. Markel Fultz, the rookies. Teodosic. Tessa Teodosic. That's right. Teo I got it right the first time. And Black Velocity. Dwight Howard. I'll go to Charlotte. That's for Ricky. Twenty-eight out of thirty-nine. He's had a he had a decent season this year. For the Clippers, for Vic, Milos, and this is not the Hollow Edition, but it's the first one we've seen in a little bit. So we'll sleeve that up for you too, Sixers. That'll be for Rodney. Markel Fultz. We should see in action a little bit. Ben Simmons. Nice. And Devin Booker. For J Mac and the Suns. Lime green to 175. That I I'd, I wouldn't be surprised if this Ben Simmons, 35 out of 79, just 10 off the jersey number. He's 25, we got 35. I wouldn't be surprised if that pink velocity actually let me top load because it has a lot more value than I think it does. That's what's great about this basketball. Like even these seemingly High numbered parallels could actually go for a lot for a lot of the top rookies and even some of the second tier rookies, too. Redemption guess Greg Monroe for the Suns. Orange, I like when the parallel matches the team colors 169, 189 out of 199. Trevor Ariza, Lime Green, and there's Robert Covington, who's on the floor right now. Is he? He is. He's got five points, a rebound, and an assist already. There's Trevor Ariza for James and the Rockets at a 175. Uh, Jaden with Giannis is his guess. No one else is going to guess? All right, Jaden, I'll give you five bucks in break credit if it's Giannis. It's Dylan Brooks. Rated rookie signatures. Almost. You almost did it. Dylan Brooks is Jazz, right? Grizzlies, right? I'm, I'm, I confused those two guys for some reason. Dylan Brooks for the Memphis Grizzlies. That goes to Jason Cox. Memphis Grizzlies. All right, next box. I got six boxes left, so we're about just about halfway through this break. We're right on track. We should be done with this in about 30 minutes or so. It'll take me about another five, 10 minutes to put this break away, clear it away, and get set up, get the next break set up, whatever it may be. Oh, I think the Angels were spot ran. The Rex was saying that. So we'll do that. That'll, that'll be pretty easy to do. And then I'll go through all the other orders and see what break we're close to. I know that Flawless Football, we were very close to filling up that Flawless Football. 
do that. Uh, we can do Tribute 19. Yeah, the Tribute 19 randoms already sold out, Rex said. So we're going to do that right after this. So that unlocks Tribute Pick Your Team 19. So the Angels will... Someone's going to get the Angels anyway, so we can fill up the Pick Your Team 19 as well. And then after we fill up Tribute or uh, Random 19 and 20, then we can do the one box random. So... If you look on the site, jazbeeshobbyland.com, folks, you can kind of track the spots left number, and you'll see that once those two disappear from the site, that it means you know they sold out. Gabriel, what's going on, man? Yeah, 2016 Bowman's Best Baseball is back. Good luck. Lime Green, Dwayne Bacon. And we've got Abdel Nader Signature Series. I'm not sure if I know who this person is, Jeremy Merle, with the Celtics, but there you go. Abdel, going your way. Can't believe you've been in Seattle for that long, Gabriel. It's kind of crazy. 152 out of 175. Lime Green, Dwayne Bacon for Charlotte. Ricky Buffalo with that one. Markeith Morris, Orange. 103 out of 199. And 34 out of 39, Black Velocity. Doug McDermott for the Knicks. That'll go to Toby. The Markeith Morris goes to Jaden, who just learned why it's called the Mendoza line. Right, hitting under 200. That was, uh, I don't know who, who it was, some guy named Mendoza. There's Bam out of Bio, missed this one. Hollow for the Heat, landed with that one. There's Jason Tatum. Uh, is Has Bam out of Bio entered the game yet? He has not entered the game yet. There's Boogie Cousins. That could be a completely different series if DeMarcus Cousins was healthy. There's Rajon Rondo, orange, 55 out of 199. There's Lime Green, Clay Thompson. He looked great. For the Warriors, James with the Warriors. Out of 175, you put the lime in the coconut. Ben Simmons, another pink velocity. There's Jared Allen, rated rookie. That's pretty crazy, Sixers, Rodney. That's for the Brooklyn Nets. He had a nice season, too. Paul Harris with that one. I wouldn't be surprised if you get if if you get a decent amount of value out of this. What's Ben Simmons doing so far in the game? I think this game's first quarter is barely over. Ben Simmons has four points, three rebounds, three assists already. With just uh four thirty left to go in the first quarter. All right, next box. ladies and gentlemen. It's been quite a busy week, folks. So thank you very much. We're going to have a busy week next week, too. A lot, a lot of, a couple of new, big new releases coming out next week in baseball and in basketball. 
National Treasures Basketball coming out next Wednesday. So be prepared for that. I mean, just take a look. Do your research over the weekend. I'm telling you that the value in basketball is a lot bigger than you think. And so you can take that data and extrapolate it to a high-end release like NT Basketball. And you can see, you can get a good idea of what that stuff could go for. For example, last year, Ben Simmons, rookie cards, right? Ben Simmons was, uh, well, his, his autographs are exclusive to Upper Deck, so that's why his, his base card can go up so much. But in Optic Basketball last year, like a Ben Simmons hollow rated rookie, what could that go for? 70, 80 bucks, 100 bucks maybe? Something like that. His base card, I think to 90, or whatever it's numbered to, whatever the base card's number to in NT, uh, his base card was like a grand. Like, it was crazy. There wasn't a lot of it, but which, which is also helps the price, but uh, there's DeMarcus Cousins Lime Green. So that just gives you a good idea of the value of this stuff. Out of 175, DeMarcus Cousins. Uh, I think that's all. That's it, Gabriel. I'm pretty sure we only have one. I think NT's 2016 NT Baseball, we have two. Or maybe it might be the other way around. Only one NT and two bests? I don't know. I'll have to check. I'll check. Remind me. I'm totally going to forget. There's DJ Augustine. Senior Series. Remind me in 30 minutes. That goes to Orlando. Ricky Buffalo. Yeah, folks. If I promised you anything during this break, uh, make, sure, make sure you remind me. 77, like for example, Jaden, like if you want me to look up that, if you haven't found any Oscar Robertsons, remind me after this break, because otherwise I'm pretty sure I'll forget about it. I think that's it. I think those are the only outstanding requests there. Joe Johnson, Jazz. Twenty-five out of ninety-nine on Joe for the Jazz. EA. And 25 out of 39, Jimmy Harden. Black Velocity for the Rockets. 25 out of 39. Kevin Love, 25 out of 199 for the Cavs. Or if anybody's bored right now, but kind of half watching the break, someone look up Oscar Robertson autographs out of like Optic or Prism or Select. And be sure to look in the sold auctions. So we can give Jade an idea of what the value is on that Oscar Robertson autograph. Because I'm curious too. Uh, Ricky Buffalo with the Orlando Magic. This DJ B. Augustine. All right, next box. Kyle Kramer, what's going on? Come on, optic packs. That's the that's the key. That's the one thing that will slow down any break is is the packaging being terrible. I don't know what it is because some, some some products is fantastic. See, that just rips apart in your hands. Some pro but some products is great. Some 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 are not. Like this. Slows me down. Uh the Oscar Robertson, I believe, was yeah, out of 49. And it was like a, a Hall Dominators autograph or something like that. One of those Dominators autographs.
my guess on value of that Oscar Robertson my guess is for the Hall Dominators 65 to 75 dollars Derek Rose That might be a little bit. No, that sounds about right. That sounds about right. 002 out of 199, Derek Rose, Kaz edition. That goes to Jared Parr. Frank Mason the third, rated rookie red. Walt Frazier, retro series red. So a couple reds. Um, 39 out of 99. Nice Walt Frazier. For the... Cavs, right. Oh, look at that old Cavs logo. I kind of like that. All right. 37 out of 99. Frank Mason the third. Oh, that's not bad. 40 to 50 bucks, says Arthur. Thanks, Arthur, for looking that up for me. And Jaden. Yeah, that sounds about that sounds about right. All right. Yeah, I was a little high, but on that guess, but I'll Sounds about right. Wasn't super off. Caleb, Swanigan, Hollow, Trailblazers, William L. With this trail, we'll, we'll see them later tonight. There's Donovan Mitchell, rated rookie Hollow. That is one autograph. This is our last case. That's so one autograph we have. We have yet to see as one that Eric EA has been chasing. DeMontis Sabonis. Rex like, what's happening in the National League? Rex, is, Rex wants to talk baseball at this basketball break. Uh, the Demonte Samoa is blue, 37 out of 49. He's saying, yeah, Pirates aren't first, Mets aren't first, Nationals aren't fourth, Dodgers aren't fourth, Brewers went down to fourth, Cubs in third. Yeah, the Diamondbacks aren't first too. You, things that we are usually not used to seeing. We're not used to seeing the Diamondbacks in first. They're never in first. They don't do that. Right? Cubs were used to seeing it third. Right, Rex? At least until the last five years it's it's East Coast bias Arthur and Joe you know you you know West Coast teams will never get credit except for LA teams he didn't even mention the Angels didn't even mention the Angels right it's only been a couple weeks it's only been a couple weeks. That's true. The covers usually last up until three years ago. The corrects Rex. That, that is true. Oh, but then there was a there was a little uh, there was a little boost with uh, the Mark Pryor, Kerry Wood years, the Bartman era. That was that was a that was a good run for a little bit. Wow, the Heat just went on a big run. They're up 35-25 with a little under 30 seconds left in the first quarter. What happened there? This is not going to help my, my, my under on the game. Did the, did the Sixers just go to sleep for a second? Wow. It's nice to see the unusual teams doing well, Rex. Joe P. Arthur, did you hear that? Your Diamondbacks are unusual. Pirates are unusual to Rex. Rex and his Rex and his big successful Cubs. They're unusual. Wow. 
this this is this is classic this is classic Cubs classic Cubs fan there. Every, everybody is lesser than them. Even when they were losing. It's Cubs superiority right there. Now Padres will be that's that's a good call though, Rex. They've got a good young team. I think they're gonna they, they, they're going to do pretty pretty well. They're going to surprise a lot of people in a couple of years. That's what he was saying, Rex or Arthur. That's what Rex was saying. They're unusual teams. Even, even my Dodgers are lumped into unusual. Willis Reed for the Knicks. Unbelievable. Unusual. Toby. With the Knickerbockers, 13 out of 49. I know we we have a, we actually have a lot of Cubs fans here. I actually have no problem with the Cubs. I just like te I just like teasing Rex. Wow, unusual for first place. Woo! Even more fighting words, Arthur and Joe P. What do you think about that? Your Diamondbacks are in first, and Rex called them unusual. Unusual for first place. Lime Green, the rookies. 163 out of 175. Lake Show, that goes to Ricky Buffalo. That's <laughs> true, yeah, the Dodgers, well, Dodgers unusually in fourth. It has been a little bit since that has happened. I. I suspected that this season might be a bit of a down season for the Dodgers this year. They didn't make a lot of big moves in the offseason. They had to get under that luxury tax which was kind of a a hammer blow to their offseason in terms of making moves. There's Juwan Evans for the Clippers for Vic. There's Jordan Bell for the Warriors. That is out. Uh, that is hollow for James. A little bit of that that World Series hangover. Nikola Vucevic, paint velocity. 2379, I like that. <laughs> Don't sleep on the snakes, Joe P says, or you'll get bit. Watch out. You got you gotta shake your boots, you gotta shake your shoes out, right, Joe P? Gotta shake your boots out. There might be a snake in there. Kemba Walker, lime green for the for the Charlotte Hornets for Ricky, sixty five and a one seventy five. Yeah, Diamondbacks are doing pretty well. <laughs> yeah, Dodgers got bit last night. That is true. They're not playing good baseball right now. This was actually the Diamondbacks team I was worried about last year. I thought down the stretch, I, I thought I knew the Dodgers were going to be pretty good last year. I, I just had a feeling, but but I thought it was going to be neck and neck with the Diamondbacks, like so. But no, it looks like it's this year. But then the Dodgers are starting slow this year, so not quite the neck and neck battle I envisioned. Yeah, actually, the whole this is true. Yes, or still early in the season, but yeah, so far, the Rockies got bit. The Padres got. Wait, have you played the Padres yet? Padres got bit. Giants got bit. They Giants may have bit themselves. That's right, Rich. There's a snake in my boot. Toy Story? I think no. no, it's still early, Gabe. I know. It's still early. The, uh, the speculation around here in Los Angeles with uh, Dodger talk, post-game show stuff, with Dave Vasse. Gabriel, you know Dave Vasse. Right. So the speculation between them and some of the other pundits around here in L.A. is that uh, there's been a uh, – I think there's been like some rain outs and some this and that for the Dodgers and whatever. So – they're saying that they haven't really gotten into a rhythm yet. Like, Kenta Maeda hadn't pitched for, like, 13 days. You know, before he made that start last night. So they're, they're saying that every, everyone's schedule is kind of, kind of all over the place. Oh, and then there was, like, that huge 
15 inning game with the Diamondbacks, and then like another 15 inning game with the Giants. So there's, so all everything's all, all off. Is the talk around LA? All right, second to last box. Good luck, everybody. We got Ben Simmons and Bill Lambeer. There's been a lot of old school guys in this signature series. Bill Lambeer. That'll go to the Pistons and Chris Newton. What's up, A? What's going on? To, to Murray, Swishful Thinking, Kristaps Porzingis. 32 out of 49, whose exit interview, recent exit interview was was much kinder, was much nicer than last year's exit interview. All right, that's for the Spurs. Blue, 24 out of 49. Spurs looking to get back on track in game two. Kevin Love, Cavs. I think we'll see them tomorrow. Out of 199 for the Cavs. That'll be for Jared Parr. Is Dirk going to keep playing? How old is he? 41? Like his jersey number? Zach Randolph. How old is Dirk? He must be on the TB12 diet. 95 out of 99. Zach Randolph for the Kings. That'll be for Ricky Buffalo. Justice is served. How's Justice Winslow doing? Is he in the game today? He's got five minutes in the game. A few assists and a rebound, no points. The playoffs, where legends are made. Any one of these guys in the playoffs could turn into something. Marcus All, Lime Green. Sixty-seven out of one seventy-five. Marcus All for the Grizz. That goes to Jason Cox. Uh, Aiden saying Dirk is as old as Dirt. Dirt. Dirt's pretty old, Aiden. I don't know if when's the last time you took a geology class, but Dirt is probably one of the oldest things out there in planet Earth. Especially if you start digging into the Earth's crust. But he is pretty old. D Dirk is pretty old. Dirk can be fra well, uh, it's, that's, that's the dirt itself is not fresh. It's just freshly dug dirt. This dirt talk was brought to you by Osh. Orchard Hardware and su Orchard Supply and Hardware. Ah, Rex, a former farmer, saying, yeah, but you can rotate the dirt. This is true. You gotta save the nitrogen inside the dirt for the for the for proper growth of crops. Good call, Rex. Maybe throw some fish in there. Throw some fish in the dirt. To give it some punch. Remember when that one dude put fish in the dirt? Okay, here we go. Last box, we made it. Boy, and none too soon. This conversation is going off the rails really fast. All right, here we go. Will Chamberlain, blue. Dirt is from erosion, and erosion is always occurring. Right, so where where is that from? from old rocks that have been on this planet for millions of years. Out of 49, Wilt Chamberlain, blue. 
And we have Lonzo Ball Signature Series for Ricky and the Lakers. My Lakers, little Laker Joe Mojo at the end. Nice. That's quite the opposite, Rex. Right? <laughs> Michael Kidd Gilchrist, 44 at 99. That's for Charlotte. Is it too late to talk about women's figure skating? Yes. Yes. We ha we handicapped women's figure skating ages ago, Jaden. You know this. One twenty five out of one ninety nine. I have a wrap for the Grizz. I don't know what the next tournament is. Is there like some some worlds, some regional, some national? I don't know. I think NBCSN tends to have that at like five thirty in the morning on a Wednesday. Jabari Parker, lime green for the Bucks. See some Jabari Parker in action at a 175 for Milwaukee. Goes to Jaden. There's Josh Jackson, the rookies. Swishful thinking. Devin Reed. And that is that. No randomizers, no nothing. That's it, folks. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. That was our last case of Optic Basketball. That might be it for Optic Basketball for the time being, but we may bring another case or two back in the future. So keep an eye out on that website right there. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.